Have you ever wondered why we eat? We eat because we need a source of energy and because our body needs building materials. The digestive system is the system which is responsible for supplying an animal's body with this energy and with these building materials. We need energy to recharge our body's supply of ATP as it is used up. Also, as we increase in size, we need to form additional cells through cell division. To make those new cells and all of their components, we need building materials, which we get from our food. For all animals, there are four steps involved with food processing. Those four steps are ingestion, digestion, absorption, and elimination. Digestion is the breakdown of food, and there are two main categories of digestion, mechanical digestion and chemical digestion. Mechanical digestion is a physical process. It is a physical breakdown of food into a more uniform mixture. This aids in the swallowing and continued processing of the food. Chemical digestion is the enzymatic breakdown of food polymers into nutrient monomers. This requires the chemical reaction hydrolysis to occur. Hydrolysis is controlled by hydrolases, enzymes specialized in catalyzing these reactions. Let's look at the four steps of food processing and where these steps occur. Ingestion is simply another word for eating. This is bringing in food into our digestive system. This occurs at the mouth or oral cavity. The next step is digestion. In humans, mechanical digestion occurs through the chewing of food in the mouth by the teeth and the churning of the stomach, mixing the food with gastric juice, which is a mixture of acid, mucus, and a few enzymes. The majority of the digestive enzymes are released into the small intestine which makes it the primary site for chemical digestion in the body. Once the polymers from our food are broken down into monomers, it is time for them to be absorbed. Absorption is the uptake of nutrient monomers from our food into the cells lining our small intestine. These cells will pass these nutrients to the bloodstream along with using the nutrients themselves for the production of polymers within the body. The food that is not digested or absorbed is consolidated into feces by the absorption of water in the large intestines. Elimination occurs when the feces is expelled from the body in the final steps of food processing. These four steps of food processing will occur in all animals, including humans. Now for some questions. Which of the following is not one of the stages of food processing? Set elimination, inflammation, ingestion, digestion, or absorption. The stomach is the primary site of chemical digestion in the human digestive system. Is this a true statement or a false statement? According to the presentation, the mouth is a major site of ingestion, mechanical digestion, absorption, all of the above, both A and B.